With your look around the Air Force, I'm Staff Sergeant Benjamin Cooper. An F-16 Fighting Falcon's electronic warfare system received its first ever in-flight software update as part of an advanced battle management system demonstration at Nellis Air Force Base, Nevada. Airborne F-16 received a mission data file update with information transmitted from hundreds of miles away using an existing beyond line of sight F-16 satellite communication system. Colonel Zachary Probist, 84th Test and Evaluation Squadron Commander, says there's a tactical need to be able to rapidly update software, especially mission data files because they tie into the pilot's ability to identify, find, and defend themselves against enemy threat systems. Talisman Sabre is a large-scale military exercise between the U.S. and Australia. This year's event took place in July with about 17,000 people from seven nations. One Australian bomber liaison officer noted it was a unique opportunity to prepare for the challenges of power projection across the vast distances of the Indo-Pacific area of responsibility. Colonel Barley Baldwin, 13th Air Expeditionary Group Commander, says the exercise builds trust and interoperability with allies and relationships that are vital to ensure a free and open Indo-Pacific region. He added that Talisman Sabre showcases the ability to deliver capable, combat-ready, lethal air power on short notice alongside partners and allies. Airmen and Guardians can submit innovative solutions to operational problems for next year's Spark Tank competition. Spark Tank 2022 will be the fifth year of the contest. William Gautier, Spark Tank Director, says the competition offers a great opportunity to highlight the innovative spirit of Airmen and Guardians. Spark Tank Innovation Awards are being introduced for 2022 to recognize innovative solutions proposed by Airmen and Guardians. The new awards are meant to spur innovation, development, and talent retention that can speed up the adoption of emerging, game-changing technologies. And that's your look around the Air Force.